DR Congo's countdown to election day a hot potato. Eight months to the definite presidential election in the Democratic Republic of Congo, the exact number of candidates or actual contenders is not yet known. Not even the election date has been set, but President Felix Tshisekedi may well know that his biggest opponent is the insecurity in the East. Not that the instability there is his making, here is a region that hasn't known true peace for the past 30 years. From UN estimates, as many as 120 armed groups roam the three provinces of North Kivu, South Kivu and Ituli. For Tshisekedi, the lack of peace, there is both an old burden and a new challenge. He came to power in 2019 and promised to wipe out the problem. But now that it still exists, voter turnout or even his popularity may be on the line. One of the biggest critics of his, uh, of his handling of the problem is Dr. Dennis Mukwege, the gynecologist who won the Nobel Peace Prize in 2018 for making life-saving operations on sexually violated women of the Congo War. Opposed to any foreign military missions in Eastern DRC, he urges the government has looked on and instability gets deeper here. And he says, who can still believe in the stabilization efforts of the east of the Yara Congo with the help of ESC force composed largely of destabilized states? He asked last week, referring to the regional mission meant to improve security in the area. It's time to review regional diplomacy and security governance to break the deadlock. Dr. Mukwege has been a critic of the ESCRF composed of Uganda, Kenya, Burundi and South Sudan troops, but that he repeated the criticism just as force completed deployment reflects the frustration on the ground. Thank you so much for watching.